Check one, two. We're recording. Good to go. Power 96, Mommy on the Rocks, Casey Chops. I have the beautiful Tyler in here. Welcome to Miami, your first you. time. Mm -hmm. I appreciate you taking the time. First and foremost, you have the biggest song in the world right now. This song, you cannot escape it. What is the craziest thing you've seen, like, video-wise with your song? Have you seen anything that's, like, stuck out to you? Definitely the babies doing it. Because, oh like, I don't know how such small little babies are able to do, like, the, the little shake and everything. It's so cute. That yeah. I find that the cutest. Wow. Yeah. And, and is there anything else that comes to mind when you just see your video everywhere on TikTok, Instagram? Yeah. I mean, like, just the fact that there's people from everywhere doing it, like, right. in Asia, Europe, America, like, mm -hmm. it's reached everywhere. And even when I went, I went to Thailand not so long ago, and mm -hmm. I was in, like, a village, like, random people, and they were able to recognize me and the song, so... Wow. It's just, it's amazing to see how far the song's gone. What is the first, like, sign of, like, it being viral that you saw? Like, when you posted it, did you know, like, okay, this is going to be out of here? Like, what was the first thing that gave you that sign, you know? Definitely when I dropped that video that went viral. Mm -hmm. Like, I dropped it just before I took off mm -hmm. in a plane. Mm -hmm. And when I landed, it was already, like, over 5 million views. And the flight wasn't that long. So I was like... <laughs> This is gonna. So you gonna take off, crazy. you post it, and you land, and now your video is viral. And crazy. You're, you're out of here. Yeah. That's crazy. Um, so you're South African, mm -hmm. and you know us from America, we're kind of ignorant to the African sound, but we're learning, right? Um, could be, before we just thought Afrobeat was Afrobeat, and then you know I went to uh, Portugal for Rolling Loud for the first time, and the DJ did a I'm a piano set. And I've never seen a vibe like that in my mm -hmm. life. It was because it's calm, it's smooth, mm -hmm. and it's sexy, and everyone's vibing. Um, how do you feel about, and let's be clear, right? Because there's a debate, but I'm a piano is South African. Yeah. Um, so you grew up to that sound, right? That sound mm -hmm. is old. That's nothing new to you, correct? Like. I mean, it's a, sh it's a genre that developed over time, mm -hmm. but the sound was always there in South Africa. But... I just remember in high school when I'm a piano became I'm a piano I'm a piano you know, mm -hmm. so I was I was definitely around the time of it birthing mm -hmm. you know so right. I'm, I, I feel like you're the one who's crossed it over to pop you've crossed over a whole sound right you have Burner Boy has his records but as far as pop hit you kind of I don't want to say you own the I'm a piano sound but you're mm -hmm. the one who made it global you know what I mean how Thank does that you. feel like you have like and that's the sound of it's you amazing, know. like, being able to bring my sound from home to the world. It's mm -hmm. something that I've always wanted to do. So, I, I don't know, I'm just enjoying it right now. And I'm so proud mm -hmm. of my country and the genre. Mm -hmm. And, yeah, I just see it going so much bigger than it already is. Right. Do you, so the plan for the album and the plan for future music, do you plan to stick in that lane? Or do you like to experiment with a bunch of different sounds? Or what is your vibe musically? I'm definitely going to experiment, but I mean, it's my sound at the end of the mm -hmm. day. So people are going to be getting that vibe, mm -hmm. and especially in my first album now that's mm -hmm. going to be dropping soon hey. in March. So, yeah, if people love Warsaw, they're going to love my album. How's that been uh, working on that? Do you record most of the music? Are, first of all, are you based in, in South Africa? Mm -hmm. So are you working, uh, doing most of the album in South Africa? Are you doing any recording over here in the States or how is that working for you? I was all over the world making this album. Wow. Like I've been working like pr probably like three years on wow. this album. And I've been like America, mm -hmm. London, Dubai, mm -hmm. Nigeria, South Africa, and just working with a bunch of people and trying to find that sound. Like before I've made Water, mm -hmm. I was still experimenting with mm -hmm. how I'm gonna mix my mm -hmm. sounds from home with pop and R&B. Right. So, yeah, it took a while to get there, but I'm there now. And you so. just collect inspiration from all the different places yeah. you go, and that's awesome, man. And, of course, I'm sure you get the, the Rihanna comparison so much, right? A lot of people, as soon as, you know, they see the video, people have said, yo, she's like a... First of all, you sing, sing. Let's be clear. Like, you can actually sing, you know? Like, there's no crazy auto-tune covering you up, but, like... Because I'm a producer, so, like, the musicality of your music, like, it's... You could... Your vocals are amazing, first Thank of all. Thank you. Um, how do you feel about that Rihanna comparison? Um, you know, you get it visually. The video is incredible, by the way. You Thank know, you. Um, I'm sure you get that Rihanna comparison a lot, right? Do you? Uh, I do see it here and there. I mean, I love Rihanna, right. so it's a compliment at the end of the day. But also, I'm my own artist. Mm -hmm. Completely different story, different right. come up, different everything. So 
I, I feel like people just want to relate the new things right. to things they're familiar with. Yeah, they want to compare right away. Right? Yeah, but I mean, I'm still, people are still getting to know me. So mm -hmm. I'm sure years from now, I'd be just Tyler. Right. Yeah. What is something that, speaking of people getting to know you, what is something that people may not know about you that, you know, that maybe would shock people or something like are you good at ping pong or something like is it like is there something that people may not know um you have a hidden talent uh i draw actually really yeah but i don't like saying it because i feel like people are gonna make me draw yeah. like when i go to interviews or whatever like i don't want to now be put on the spot you know but i draw i enjoy doing that in uh, in school like i love art yeah, yeah. good man you should draw your artwork on your apple that'd be pretty crazy that's Maybe, awesome. Yeah. So if you had to choose between, and um, it, clearly you're into fashion as well, right? If you had mm -hmm. to choose art, well, music, art, or fashion. Like, ooh, ooh, Why ooh. would you make me choose? Right? That's hard, right? Yeah, like I feel like it all goes in to each other. That's true. Yeah, so. That's true. Outside of music, what do you like to do? Is there, what, what do you do to like calm down, to wind down? I'm sure all this fame is new to you right is it, mm -hmm. is it a bit overwhelming at times definitely at times uh but i mean it's what comes with it at the end of the day right and the fact that i'm enjoying enjoying what i'm doing and mm -hmm. i'm able to do all of this mm -hmm. it kind of makes it easier you right. know but um yeah what was your question is i even it, forgot what you said. Like, <laughs> like what is something that you know brings you peace that oh, helps yes. you escape from all of that i mean my family like my family keep me grounded like they don't care how much how famous i get or how big the song gets like they'll mm -hmm. keep me grounded um so definitely that but also like i love just going to theme parks and theme parks yeah i love theme like parks. roller coasters yeah wow mm -hmm. like so you're like an adrenaline person? Like you jumped out of an airplane before? No, I won't do that. Like okay. not Over here we fight alligators, yo. You want to fight an alligator? Uh, mm -mm. No? Nah? Okay. Like theme parks, I'll go there. But mm -hmm. flying and what? Skydiving? Sky but no. no. Nothing that I could die with. No. No. <laughs> That's funny. Water, over 450 million streams. The U.S. tour is almost sold out, which is crazy. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about that? Like well, what goes into the, the show? Like how do you think about per, per, the performance aspect of it? I mean, with everything that I do, I think about like, what can we do that's different and like bigger than what it is now, you know? So, I mean, for the tour, I don't want to say too much because I feel like I want people to just see it mm. for what it is. I don't want people to expect anything, you know? Right. But yeah, I just know that it's going to be amazing. People are going to feel South Africa from the show mm -hmm. and yeah. That's awesome. As far as fashion goes, um. Do you consider yourself like a stylist? Do you like to style yourself? Like, where, where, where does your mind go as far as the fashion and the fits? Um, yeah, I love playing with outfits, playing dress up, like working with people, trying new things. Mm -hmm. I find it so fun. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I'm you, definitely in this fashion. Do you have space. any favorite brands? Any? I'm not really a brand girl, to be honest. Like, anything that looks good, I'll wear it. Like, right. whatever brand it is, no matter right. how much it costs, even like. So, you're rocking like the $10 Fashion Nova outfits. Then, yeah, <laughs> like, like, anything, like, like anything, like anything like, that is hot, I'd wear it. Yeah. That's what's up. So we'll do a little rapid fire questions, okay? Okay, okay. Um, red wine or white wine? You drink wine? I don't know. No, no drinking at all. Not really. That's good. Do you, do you have a vice? Like, do you have mm. Mm, like a guilty pleasure, a vice, anything? Uh, I love like sweets, S Ooh, like ice sweet creams, tooth. chocolates. Yeah. Girl, my New Year's resolution, I'm doing so good with the diet until 10 p.m. Okay. So the diet is on point, chicken, low carbs, vegetables, but then at nighttime, it's you 17 Oreos, yeah. three scoops of ice cream, like, yeah. so that's your vice. Yeah, but I've actually gotten better. Mm -hmm. Now I'm more like soda, which is bad. Ooh. But, but your water, you gotta... Water, <laughs> yeah, water always, but I also, I love like a Sprite the, or like the a soda Diet mix? Coke or, yeah. yeah. But yeah. I'm sure you've had so many water brands like come yeah, up. Yeah, water. Like, yeah, water's important, yo. I, yeah. I just got this expensive filter, like, because they said you can't drink water from plastic anymore. So now, Who said that? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's terrible for you, like, to drink water from plastic. It has, um, what is that word? Microfiber. Micro yeah, yeah, it's got the, yeah. 
lowers testosterone and all that. So now I got this, bro, I got this expensive water filter that now everything mm. I drink is with the hydro flask and from that water, it's A whole it's process. Different. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, would you rather have the boyfriend who plays video games a lot or the boyfriend who's always in the club? Video games all day. Really? Yeah. A club guy, no. Like, what the heck? But what if it's his job? Mm. So you'd rather have the guy playing Call of Duty all day? like? Rather that than a club every okay. weekend. Like, at least I know you'd be chilling. We're at home. I also love being at home and chilling. Are you a chilling. gamer? I, I'm not a gamer, mm -hmm. but I like playing games. If you got to play a game, what's the go-to? Call of Duty. Call of Duty? Yeah. Okay. That's what's up. It, I mean, as far as the dating goes, you just don't have time, right? What is, how's that? Are you single? Or? You're going straight to that question. <laughs> um, yes, I'm single. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I'm not playing with all of that right now. Uh, Focusing like on Stay focused. The prize. Stay focused. So she'd rather have the video game boyfriend. Lipstick or lip gloss? Gloss. Uh, so you don't drink tequila or henny, I won't ask you that. Shower or bath? Shower. Uh, Burna Boy or Davido? Don't ask me this. Okay. <laughs> ice coffee or hot coffee? You, coffee? I, I don't really drink coffee, but if I had to, ice coffee. Ice coffee. Yeah. Okay. Um, appetizer or dessert? Mm, desserts. Oh, yeah. Sweet <laughs> yeah, tea. Yeah, yeah. That's right. Short nails or long nails? Short nails. Short nails. Uh, introvert or extrovert? Uh, extrovert. Extrovert. Oh, sometimes. I don't know. Introvert sometimes, extrovert. Introvert sometimes. to recharge to be an extrovert. Yeah, like I can be an extrovert for a little bit and then I start getting tired of people. I'm the same, of yeah, people. Then I'm just, of people. Yeah, 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 yeah I'm, I'm the same exact way. Uh, love or money? Love. Love. Uh, Beamer or Benz? You're a car person? I'm not really a car person, yeah. to be honest, so yeah. Okay, condo or house? What's the difference between a condo and a house? Uh, one is like living on top of each other, like a condo, like a, okay. something like this, or having okay. your own house with a yard and... House. Okay. I love just like... Nature? Yeah, having a yard, like having neighbors, like... Are you an yeah. animal person? You have pets? I have dogs, yeah. Dogs? Mm. No cats? Mm. Not a, good. I'm, I'm not to, really a cat person. Me either, I'm allergic. Oh, I can't okay. find a girlfriend who doesn't have cats. Now I gotta break up because I'm allergic. Oh, it's okay. crazy, yeah. Um... Would you rather hear an uncomfortable truth or a comforting lie? Uncomfortable truth. All day. Like, I, I want people to just be honest with me. Like, even if it's ruthless, like, I can take it. Even if it hurts? Definitely, even if it hurts. I'd rather, I'd rather be in pain and then fix something than then, not know. Yeah. You know? But ignorance is bliss, right? Uh, no. no. Yeah. What, what is your sign? Uh, Aquarius. Aquarius? Mm. Okay. Um, would you rather be skiing in Aspen, like in the snow, skiing, mm. or parasailing in Puerto Rico? Parasailing in Puerto Rico. I love the heat. Like, I'm a summer girl, Tropical beach girl. girl, yeah. Does it get cold in South Africa? Forgive my ignorance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah it right? gets cold, yeah. It, but it's it's summer over there now, right? Or no? Yeah, it's still yeah, summer. Right? Yeah, right, um, yeah. What would you rather do, laundry or dishes? Yo, oh, laundry. Laundry? I hate dishes. Oh, you know when the food gets there and then your hands. Oh, and then you leave it. Now it has a smell. But sometimes dishes could be therapeutic. You put in the headphones. And I'm just saying. Like, uh, I don't. I hate. You know? I hate touching dirty things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I rather. Yeah, no. I yeah, got you. Oh, uh, would you rather have order in or eat out? Eat order in. Order in. Would you have the rather have the smart boyfriend or the funny boyfriend? Funny. The funny boyfriend. Okay. Uh, no, but. Okay, smart. Smart? Yeah. Well, some people would say to be funny is to be smart, right? I don't know about all that. But, <laughs> <laughs> funny is nice, but when it's too much, it gets irritating. Like, you know yeah. when people that just don't know when to stop? Yeah, well, there's people who are funny, then there's people who are funny like a clown funny. I don't like clowns. Yeah, funny. I don't like clowns I either. like natural, like naturally Clever, funny. funny yeah, yeah, like you're not trying too hard, it just happens, you know? Awesome. Yeah, that type of funny. So I appreciate you taking the time to do this. You didn't have to do this. Is there something you want to tell your fans? Um, uh, hello, Tigers. Hope you guys are good and looking forward to the album because it's going to be amazing. Damn, I, that, my girl does that hand motion. I have trauma yeah, from that sorry. hand motion. I have trauma. Why, what do you mean you have trauma? Uh, because usually when that hand motion comes out, she's... She's what? She's angry? Yeah. Oh. She's talking at me, you know? No, it's just... The yeah, vibes. Nothing bad, yeah. Casey Chops, Tyler, Power 96, Miami on the Rocks. Scott, thank you, bro. Yeah, <laughs>